guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we'll be talking about red lipsticks and as you know, Valentine's Day is coming up and I'm pretty sure to those who have partners, you've already set your date night. But if you're single, girl, don't worry, you will still be serving looks that day because you never know you might score a hot date. So let me help you by showing you my top 10 red lipsticks in the market. So stay tuned. So the red lipsticks that I will be showing you will range from affordable to high end. So I have something as cheap from Rimmel London and as expensive as Pat McGrath. So I've got nothing in my lips now, it's just my natural lip color. So we have MAC in Russian Red and it's a warm toned red. It's matte, it glides on really well into your lips. It's gorgeous in color. So this red is very nice, it's classic, but it does not make your teeth white, unfortunately. MAC has another red which is called Ruby Woo, I think, and that one's quite nice too. Next is the Chanel 762 in Image Rose. It looks like this. It's a very, very nice red and it's in a really classy packaging with the Chanel logo. I love this so much. I only use this for a special occasion. So let's try it on. It smells amazing. I can smell the rosy scent of it. This kind of red is really nice because it's like you just bit in your lip kind of red, if you get what I mean. It's not super bold but it's not super dainty as well. This is really nice. It's a satin finish, so you will need to reapply this once in a while, but it smells amazing. Next in our list is the Stay Matte Lip Color from Rimmel London, and this is actually one of the newest one in the market. I haven't actually tried this yet, like to go out, but I have tried it in my lips. And oh my gosh, there is just something about liquid lipstick that I love so much and this is no exception. Let's try it on. It looks a bit similar to the MAC Russian Red, but this one is more velvety. It's also warm undertone, which is very good for people who have the same skin tone as me. What do you guys think? Next is the ColourPop in the color Silhouette. So I love ColourPop. It's so affordable, but they have a range of colors and they actually have a lot of reds. Um, I have Avenue and there was another one, I can't remember the name, but this one I think tops them. So as you can see, it's much more intense than the previous red that we've shown. I love it because ColourPop liquid lipstick stays on like forever so if you're going on a date and you want it to last until the end of the morning then you better take this one in your and you're good to go next is this brand which i cannot pronounce to save my life yes that so I got this from a beauty box subscription and I was in love with it. I've never heard of this brand until this. It's waterproof, transfer proof, high color payoff matte lipstick in the shade Winter Berry. So it's a crayon. Let's try it on. Look at that color, it's gorgeous. I don't think it's warm tone or cool tone. I feel like it's neutral red. I don't know if there's such a thing. This is very handy if you want just a quick touch up, in and out and go. Next is one of my favorite red lipsticks. I mean, all of them are my favorite, but this one, this one wins in packaging. It's the Pat McGrath Matte Trans Lipstick. So it's in the shade Vendetta. Look at that packaging. Isn't it so gorgeous, so classy? Look how matte that is. Let's try this on. 
So my boyfriend knows my love for red lipstick, so he got this for me on my birthday. So yeah, and I love it because it glides on so smoothly and it just looks so cute. If you're wearing like a clear pouch for a night out or something, and that would definitely look so cute on your pouch. The only downside with this is it's not kiss proof, so you'll definitely have to reapply it once in a while. So next is this lipstick from a local brand where I'm from, the Philippines. And it's called Sunny's Face. It's in the shade Major and it looks like this. How amazing does that red look? It feels like what Marilyn Monroe would wear, kind of red. So this is a blue tinted red and you might think, Mm, hang on, I'm warm undertone. Will it really work for me? Yes, girl, it would. This makes my teeth so white. Let me show you. Alright, see, I told you. I love this red lipstick because one, I feel like I'm buying local from my own country. Two, it glides on like butter and it makes me look like a boss. So, you know. It's a win-win situation. You guys might be surprised for the next one, but it's actually one of my favorites. It's Mary Jo K by Kylie Cosmetics. And let me tell you, this is one of the best red I've ever had. And I also like because there's a lip liner that comes with it. So, you know, girl, you make my life easier, Kylie. The Kylie Mary Jo K also is a blue tinted red, which makes your teeth white, which is so weird because I started off using this red lipstick and I didn't know about blue and warm tone yet before but this looked amazing on me despite it being a blue tinted red and I'm sure you guys can pull it off as well. The only downside it is a bit drying but it stays on forever. So next is L'Oreal and look how cute that packaging is. This is actually from a limited edition Beauty and the Beast box set and it's in the shade Color Rich. 335 and this is the color. It's such a gorgeous color. Let's try it on So this is a satin lipstick. It has a little bit of a gloss in it You can see it from the light reflecting from my ring light that would literally blind your first date Also lipsticks like this would help people who have thin lips because it would accentuate it more if you overline it a little bit and then just add it on it would the light would bounce back and make your lips look bigger you get what i mean yeah so the last one in our list is jeffree star unicorn blood i save this for last for a reason not because there's like a one to ten ranking of it but because this is the hardest to take off once you put it in your lips if you want something long lasting you go for jeffree star cosmetics but girl if you eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner with this, you are sorted. You don't have to reapply. I mean, joking aside, you do, but this is, I think, one of the creme de la creme of the red lipstick. So let's try it out. Isn't that such a gorgeous red? So this is obviously a liquid lipstick. If I said ColourPop lasted forever, Jeffree Star Unicorn Blood will last forever and ever and ever. Also, it's a very like vampy kind of red. So if, you, if you're into that, then I would suggest going for this. All of the lipsticks that we've tried on today are actually my favorites and they all suit a different skin type and skin color. So if you're warm undertone, then definitely go for something also warm undertone. But there is no boundary or limitation for you not to try the blue tinted reds because it does look amazing on your teeth it makes your teeth look white and sparkly and there is no straight cut in makeup you can try whatever the f you want wearing red lipstick is such an empowering color it exudes confidence passion and power and girl you better go out there get your perfect red lipstick shade and conquer the world i hope you guys learned a thing or two about red lipsticks today and leave me a comment in the comment section below telling me which one was your favorite or if you have your own favorite let me know because i would love to try it out good luck finding that perfect red lipstick and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. This has been May and I will see you in the next video. Bye!